Each quarter, uh, every couple months, every three months or so, I try to sign up for like high fashion events in um, Wichita, Kansas, Cedar Rapids. There's some even in Missouri that I go to, Southern Missouri, uh, Springfield, Missouri. And these are high-end fashion events, and I like to go. It's kind of funny. I tell people I go, and they don't believe me. They look at me, and they're like, well, you're not very fashionable. Yeah, I might not look very fashionable, but, you know, I have um, this that I've got to work with. Uh, would you like to be uh, listed on our local maps for a five ninety nine a month? Hello? And it's a calling, it's a passion, and it's something I feel like I could really excel at is kind of miniature fashion for my finger. Uh, my coworkers here don't really understand it, but I think, you know, more or less they all like me a lot and they kind of support what I do um, in, in fashion world. I've not gotten a lot of attention yet, but I plan to kind of go big. Okay, bye. Uh, uh, yeah, so the new intern, he's working out all right. He, uh, you know, he's, he's catching on a little slow, but he's doing okay. He's, the main thing is he's got, like, I don't know, like this finger thing he does, like where I don't even know how to explain it. I guess he, like, dresses them up like dolls or something. And usually I just kind of cut it out of paper, like I said, during my downtime at work. Um, but we'll, if you can, just kind of go in close here, and I'll show you some of it. This is a hat. It's uh, an all-white lineup for the fall, which I think is kind of going against, you know, the grain of, of typical high fashion. Uh, I usually go ahead and draft them on paper first, and then I'll go ahead and and cut them out, actually, from those. So it's almost a lot like the fashion industry in the fact that I have patterns that I work with, that I design. Uh, I'm inspired sometimes at night. Sometimes I'm just inspired during the day uh, while I'm on, at work, really, you know, so... This one I like a lot. Um, when I was younger, I did lose my finger in a uh, sewing machine that my mom was operating. So I don't know if that's maybe like something psychological is why I like doing this now and maybe why I work predominantly with paper and I no longer use um, or have I've never used, I guess, actual cloth. I like this design a lot. And like last time I was there eating lunch, like he like was like really like trying to show us all this stuff with his finger. And I don't even know if I'm eating lunch, I don't want to see it. And he like brings it in there and thinks we all like it. And I don't I honestly don't even know what it is. Like, does do people do that? Because I've never heard of a finger fashion show. Here's one I really like a lot. Yeah, if you go back there in the lunchroom, he's got like a little like I don't know what it is, like cardboard. Uh, I mean, it looks like trash, but it's a cardboard runway or something, and he sticks his fingers through it. And he like dresses him up in like, little outfits, and I don't know what he does. Kind of got a system here I'll, I'd like to show you. I don't show a lot of people this, but it's something that I really, really I think kind of makes it. So let me show you how this works. Uh, the other day, I walked by his computer, and like he's got like I don't know, like, he looks at fingers and stuff all day. Uh, he's kind of obsessed with it. Ready. Uh, I think because it's not on a body too, you could do more with fashion. You're not um, subject to gender or um, you know uh, body types. You're able to do more uh, for the sake of fashion than you could with the actual human model. I've Googled um, finger fashion before, and there's not a lot, so I feel like I'm on the thing on the forefront of it. So if you Google finger fashion, I don't think you'll be able to find anything, um, including my own website, which is weird. I don't know why I can't ever find it via Google. Sometimes you're still able to find my old MySpace page, but I tried to delete the photos off of that because that was before I really knew what I was doing. But, uh, I mean, I've got years worth of this stuff. Uh, I just kind of want to show you a little bit what I'm doing today. So, if you like, uh, you know, my fashion, uh, maybe I'll start a Kickstarter page or something. He dresses his finger up, and I don't think anybody here understands it, or nor ever will. <laughs>